Hey everybody, Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak. So we're gonna do a little technique just to kind of help you work on your palpation skills and to see the test of a joint in the cervical spine specifically can open or close. So we're gonna do closing meaning sliding down, opening meaning sliding forward. So we typically say when we extend, the joints glide downward. When we flex, they glide forward, right? So what we can do is we can go to, we could rotate, so we're gonna show you through here is I could rotate to a specific level. So I gotta get your palpation skills and find the articular pillar. And you have to go in pretty deep. Most people kind of go in, they palpate, but you gotta get in, they always say wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. So you get your, your, your finger on the joint. So now I'm on the articular pillar. So let's say this is C3 on four. I'll be on, I wanna test three on four. So my finger's right on three on four. I rotate to the level so I feel it hit my finger. And I test the extension, I just kind of push my finger down on four and I move three over four. So there's the ability to close on this side. I could also do it in the same position. So whatever side I'm on, the side I'm testing. So I'm testing closing on this side. I'll test closing. And the opening, keep the head turned and I just tilt away. And you want to feel, that's harder to feel if you're taking one joint away from the other and come back. You can go from segment to segment. So now I'm doing five on six. I'll grab, I'll rotate to the level. I'll go down to six and I'll hold it and go six under five. And then to opening, I'll go that direction. And you feel it's an opening problem. If I can't, if it doesn't have a good end feel that way. The key is what does the end feel like? If it has a stiff blocking end feel, per se the joint's not moving well. For flexion, a little harder, but you kind of feel it doesn't have that good spring when you get to the end feel. So it's good to use, you could use it clinically to kind of get your hands better at feeling end ranges and feels. You can also use it as a technique. I might go to the position and I say, oh, we can't close on that side. I might say, Antonio, hold your head there, let me push it, hold, two, three, four, five, relax. I can go over it and mobilize it. All right, so a nice way to kind of get, get your hands on, get to feel opening and closing of a joint. Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak.